Hi, this is Carol Harnett with the One Take Work, Love, Play Daily Video Blog. And I'm calling this video blog, Leading by Action, Character versus Charisma. And it's been inspired by a number of different things that have happened and have happened and will happen. And I'll start with my column currently, which will um, go into the archives on Monday and a new one will go up on Tuesday, or, or on Monday as well for HR executive, which I have to say for FCC regs, um, is a client. They hire and pay me to write that column. That said, it was about Harry Kramer, who leads by values. And then in the last week, our, our good new, new friend, Roy Tuscany, who's the president and co-founder of the High Fives Foundation, did a video about his five-year anniversary of his accident, uh, which I'll put a link into uh, in the body of this so you can see that. And he's a, a great leader by action. And both men made me think about this concept that another friend talks about, which is character versus charisma. And he said, what you're really looking for in people is you're looking for character. But you don't really see it very often. What you, what you may sometimes see are these people that you're drawn to, that you listen to their message, are really much more charismatic than have a background of character. Rarely do we find both combined in people. So his idea is find those people with character and embrace them. Don't be, you know, enjoy the charisma of other people, but don't be so taken by it. And rarely, rarely, you'll find people like Harry Kramer and Roy Tuscany who have both character and charisma. There was a book I was reminded of when he was talking about this that I read a really long time ago. Um, I was just working, I was in a satellite of the Olympic training program, and we associated with the local rehab hospital for our benefits. And uh, like at the really young age of 24 or 25, I get plucked because I was a good clinician to be the new assistant director of the center, and I knew nothing about being an assistant director. And so I just started reading books, random books, and I read this book called Swim with the Sharks. Harvey K, I want to say, was the author, but that's probably wrong. And uh, he said this one thing that reminded me of my situation. He said, if there's a really charismatic leader, he said, look to the person's right, and there should be somebody sitting down who's kind of just pretty methodical, and or geeky, and or a note taker, and they're the ones who actually have the character to put into place what the charismatic leader is saying. So this message has actually been out there. What I'm going to finally end with is I'm at the top of what they call here in Connecticut a mountain, which by any stretch of the imagination is just a hill. But I just ran up a trail that uh, I have never done before. It is long, and it is very rocky, and I have always avoided it because I'm always afraid of falling, and I finally figured it out. Really what you have to do is these things that Harry Kramer and Roy Tuscany do, not only do they have a really clear, very specific mission, but they look five steps ahead to see where it's headed, and then they set the, set the initial footfall toward that path. What I was always doing when I do these tricky things that seem risky to me kind of trails is I look specifically at the next step. Well, lo and behold, when I started looking five steps ahead, I just kind of flew up the trail so I think attached to character is the ability to look forward and take some risks. And as another friend told me, sometimes death or risks um, choose you. And sometimes they don't. But either way, just look ahead. So this is Carol Harnett with the One Take Work, Love, Play Daily Video Blog saying that I hope you've had some great work today, even, if it's, even though it's Saturday and hopefully you've only done a little, that you've enjoyed some tremendous love and, of course, that you haven't forgotten to play. Thanks.